Good morning, everybody. This is uh, Pastor Barbara, a.k.a. Preacher with Parrots. Um, it's about uh, 10 minutes to 9 Pacific time. I want to read you the last update that I had. It reads as follows. It was sent at 8.44, just um, about an hour ago. The steroid Mia Grace was taking yesterday, that would have been Tuesday, made the swelling around the tumor shrink. That's good. However, it caused a reaction in the pituitary gland to react to create high levels of sodium that had resulted in diabetes insipidus. This is why the excessive thirst and urination. Mia Grace does not, sorry, Mia Grace does have a catheter. It was the roughest when Mia Grace was withheld liquids for two hours yesterday. She kicked, screamed, and tried to pull out her IV. She was so thirsty and couldn't understand why her parents weren't caring to give her something to drink. She was even biting off the IV cords. At 11.15 a.m. this morning, that's um, a little over a half hour ago, Mia Grace was wheeled into surgery. The neurosurgeon said it would be anywhere between 3 to 13 hours long. Afterwards, she will have to be sterile as she will have a line to her artery. Surgery was almost postponed as Mia Grace literally threw up on her mom as they were wheeling her away. But it was determined it was food from Monday and not yesterday. So the surgery proceeded. It was good it happened when it did. We're waiting for updates, as we are told we will get updates every two hours from the surgeon during surgery. This is the end of that update. And um, you know that just because somebody says we're going to get in touch with you every two hours, it doesn't always happen that way. Doctors do what they need to do, and um, a good time to stop and give information, um, they do that when they can. You can get information by going and uh, scrolling down at the end of this video. There is a place for uh, comments. As I get comments during the day, I will be away from home. But both you and I can access uh, this video from any device, uh, even your cell phone, tablet, wherever you are. Just come to this video. You don't have to listen to it again. Scroll down. If there is anything with my name, that will be the last thing. If Tracy wishes to uh, post there also, she may do so because it is... Um, for comments, and it is open to anybody who may make comments on um, YouTube. So that's the way I probably won't be giving you information any other way for at least 24 hours. Uh, we have tried something like this before, and it has worked because people from around the world can get the information, they can leave comments, uh, eventually this will be deleted. Uh, but it will be up for as long as it needs to. That means you don't have to write or call or text me. And um, I just have to give the information once. Tracy, our partner, just has to give, pass the information from the surgeon onto us just once. I think this will work. Blessings on you. Scroll down. Uh, look for the date and the time, and you'll know when you have the most recent. Blessings on you.
keep her in prayer today and in the days to come.